Most voters in the city say the New York Police Department has been effective in fighting terrorism since 9-11, and that the police department has acted appropriately in its dealings with Muslims. This is according to a new Quinnipiac poll. Maurice Carroll is director of the poll. Since 9-11, there hasn't been a successful terrorist attack in New York, and the Quinnipiac University poll shows that New York City voters are reacting well to this. They think the New York City police are doing a good job on terrorism. Eighty-two percent tell Quinnipiac that they think the cops are doing a good job against the terrorists. In the poll, 58 percent of people said the NYPD was not mistreating Muslims. Well, what about the fuss about are they picking on Muslims? No. New Yorkers tell Quinnipiac they don't think that the cops are treating Muslims unfairly. The poll comes after a series of stories by the Associated Press detailing the NYPD's widespread surveillance of Muslims since 9-11. Yes, I believe the uh, NYPD is doing an excellent job with surveillance. I don't see uh, why uh, the Muslim neighborhood should be offended. Uh, The threat comes from the Muslim countries. That's where our terrorists reside. I'm sure that they are cooperating, but... Um, what what community would the NYPD um, go to uh, to look for terrorists? An Irish neighborhood, Italian neighborhood? I, I don't understand all the confusion. Religious leaders from different faiths gathered Tuesday at the Riverside Church of New York to criticize the NYPD surveillance program. Reverend Stephen Phelps did not put much faith in the poll results. Yes, it's in the nature of power, isn't it? to look to those who are comfortable and sleek, if I may say it, a great biblical word, and to focus one's power development on them who already have power. This is the nature of electoral process in America. In fact, however, we are committed to using democracy for the rights of the least, of those who do not have power. The group is calling for more religious tolerance training at the NYPD and an outside inspector general with subpoena power over the police department. Ted Chaffrey, Associated Press, New York.